Over the weekend, Florida's First Lady Casey DeSantis made her first public appearance since it was announced she's been diagnosed with breast cancer. News for Jack's reporter Joe McLean spoke to doctors about why this announcement and the public awareness it brings is as important as ever. A warm welcome this weekend at a Republican Party event in Hernando County as Florida's First Lady Casey DeSantis made a surprise appearance during her husband's keynote address. Her first appearance since announcing she's battling breast cancer. But I'll tell you one thing is for sure. I'm sure as hell not giving up. But to steal some lines from the strongest, most courageous person I have ever met in my life, who is my husband, to steal some lines from him, I have only begun to fight. The short video was posted to the governor's social media pages, and today he spoke out about his spouse's speech. It was really an inspirational message, an inspirational moment, and basically her message is this is not something that anyone should have to deal with, but unfortunately these things happen in life, and so the, the key is, is, is she's going to respond with, with courage and determination, and she's not going to be denied. The diagnosis and the First Lady's message arrived during Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and a particularly important one at that. A July study published in the Journal of the National Cancer Institute showed a decline in the number of people getting breast cancer screenings during the first six months of the COVID-19 pandemic, which is a problem because as fewer people get tested, more cancers could be going undiagnosed. It's very important because um, early detection is key. One in eight women will get breast cancer in their lifetime, and the earlier this cancer is caught, the more treat treatable it is. The study found that up to 1,200 deaths in the U.S. could be the result of that six-month decline in mammograms, but increased awareness in the general public could help offset that number. Now, if you're wondering where can I get a mammogram at free or low cost, one of the locations is here at the health department in Duval County, but there are a lot of them. We have a full uh, a, a list of places where you can get one for free or uh, at a reduced cost if you qualify. We've got a list of places and uh, the details for qualification. It's all inside this story on our website, newsforjacks.com. Reporting live, I'm Joe McLean, Channel 4, The Local Station.